Professor Lauri Aaltonen from the University of Helsinki. Could you tell me more about your most recent discovery? Well, we have identified uh, an important driver mutation for uterine lyomyomas, or fibroids, as they are also called. Um, this tumor type is clinically very important because it's very common. It's estimated that about 60% of women uh, by the age of 45 are affected, and not all of them have symptoms, but many do. These symptoms uh, are, are an important cause of uh, morbidity. There is abnormal bleeding, pain, uh, infertility. Uh, myomas are the most common reason for uh, hysterectomy, which is a very common procedure. Uh, so while these are benign tumors, they are not cancers, uh, they cause a very significant uh, health burden to women. Mm. Uh, it could well be estimated that uh, hundreds of millions of women uh, carry lyomyomas, and indeed uh, many have symptoms. What, the, what does this discovery mean for the treatment of these diseases? Uh, well, very little uh, today, of course. But it's a giant step towards understanding these lesions. Very little has been known about them previously. Uh, of course, there is a lot of good work done, but, uh, but uh, such specific, very frequent uh, gene mutations as we have now discovered uh, have not been previously identified. Um, and of course, this provides some hope for the future. So it would be, considering how frequent these tumors are, a very significant uh, step forward in, in uh, health care if myomas could be treated uh, by drugs. But like I say, it's very early days, but it's a very significant step, uh, even though it is almost the first step. Thank you, Professor Lauri Aaltonen from the University of Helsinki.